Now at 9 o'clock, the Butte County Sheriff's Office is investigating the murder of an East Bay man, the victim killed in his tent while he was camping in Oroville on Saturday. 20-year-old Tyler Dixon of San Pablo was a former quarterback at El Cerrito High School. Good evening, everyone, and welcome. I'm Catherine Heenan, in for Grant Lotus. And I'm Vicki Liviakis. Crown Forest Taylor Basaki talked to family members about the latest details. Tyler Dixon was a well-known athlete here at El Cerrito High School where he graduated in 2019. His godfather says that he had a college football scholarship and a very bright future ahead of him. Unfortunately, now that's all gone and his family is devastated, still looking for answers. Just a great kid though. You know, he, he was a kid that always was I mean, he was first to practice. He was he was last there to leave. Andre Williams was heartbroken when he learned his godson, 20-year-old Tyler Dixon, was killed on Saturday while on a camping trip at the Bidwell Canyon Marina Campground in Oroville, located in Butte County. He was just a gentle giant, and his mom and them they 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 they, uh, they raised him right. He, he came he came from from a great family, and it's just tragic that this have happened to a kid like that who was already on scholarship. Williams says Dixon had a scholarship to Western Colorado University for football. Dixon graduated from El Cerrito High School in 2019 and was the former quarterback of the football team. Williams says he also played basketball. It's really devastated this community here because he was one of the ones that we knew was going to make it and come back and help these kids out. And right now, we're just in mourning. While it's been a few days since Dixon died, Williams says many questions still linger. He says Dixon was on the trip with his girlfriend's family at the time and later learned that Dixon was shot and killed in the abdomen while inside his tent. What we do know is supposedly someone came in his tent uh, while him and uh, his girlfriend was sleeping, just shot one time and, and, uh, and hit he shot him and, and, and ran off. Real puzzling, especially when I talk to his mom, because there's no answers and it's just like, it doesn't make any sense. So far, the Butte County Sheriff's Office put out limited information and have not named any suspects. They say the investigation is ongoing and they're asking the public to come forward with any information they may have. In El Cerrito, Taylor Bisaki, Cron 4 News.